video so the first thing you guys are going to want to do is you guys are going to need to take off all your um, accessories except for your hair and your face accessories so I'm going to do that now so uh, yeah alright guys so once you guys have changed your avatar you guys are going to want to go to create develop or edit whatever it has for you guys and then you guys are going to want to uh, create a new game. I am just going to use the world. Um, how I'm going to use um, the world, the f um, flag rattles. This one has a picture picture from Google, so um, I don't think people will play it since. Uh, it looks kind of bad, so, Roblox Studio, okay guys, so, I might even delete this game, because this is just, like, weird, I don't know why I created this game, but, um, so, once, it, so, uh, this is loading, guys, you guys can comment in the comments, Jack, um, Jake, Bacon Blocks, Mr. Sharky Plays, or Jake. So once you guys are on flag battles or whatever game or whatever test game you have, um, you guys are going to want to search up here at the toolbox. You're going to search. Uh, what you're going to search is this. You're going to search. Um, uh, you're going to search any type of color you want. So I'm going to do. I'm going to choose red. And then you're going to type in wall. So you're going to type in red wall or whatever color wall you want. And you're going to select the wall that people like most. So this one is a little bit good. It's just that we need to scale it a little bit higher. There we go. Alright, so once you guys have gotten your wall, you guys are going to want to make a model of yourself. So you guys are going to go to plugins, and the plugin will be uh, in the description below. So once you guys have downloaded the plugin, you guys are going to see this already pro and stuff like that. This is not your username, so all you have to do is click on this, and then backspace everything, and enter in your username. Alright, so I think this will work, so we're just going to spawn this, and it should work. I'm not really sure if it worked. Hold on, let's try this one more time. Let's click spawn now, 15. R6, okay. I have no idea if this is where, oh, okay. Alright, so we got three models of us down here. So you're just going to delete uh, two of them, so we're going to do one delete, you guys, and then we're going to do two deletes. So now uh, we can close this, and now we have one model of ourselves. So now we're just going to move this all the way to the uh, red screen, or the red wall, whatever you call it. So we're just going to move that. So I'll see you guys once I have moved it. So once you guys have done that, uh, you guys will be lined up with the red wall. So uh, just move a little bit here. So once you guys have done that, you guys 
are going to want to uh, click on this uh, this arrow and it will see all the different types of things here so you're just going to delete all the mess mesh meshes like this then you're gonna delete this then this you're gonna delete everything except for the hair the uh, your face accessories your hair and um, and your uh, head so if you don't have hair then just delete you then just uh, delete your character <laughs> I guess so yeah let's just do this right now all right so you guys are going to um, keep the humanoid root part because you're going to need that so once you guys have done that you guys are going to go to head and you guys are going to erase the face or should i say delete it and now it will um now your character will look like this so now we're just going to click on the word head move this up a little bit and uh it's okay if it does like that because all we're gonna do is just move the humanoid part. Um, humanoid part. Just gonna move that up. The head. Just gonna move it up to the humanoid part. And then we're gonna move the fabulous hair up to here and then we're gonna get the nerd glasses up to here and boom guys now we're just going to zoom in uh okay we're just gonna zoom in like uh i'm just gonna zoom in a little bit for this so now once you got the right angle you guys are going to want to click the Windows 10 button on your keyboard, and it's going to bring you to here. So you're just going to go to Katana or whatever you have, and you're just going to search, um, what was that tool called? Snitch tool? Uh, what was that thing called again? Uh, what was that thing called? Uh, snitch tool. Let's just use snitch. Snitch. Okay, so guys, um, I, I have to remember the name. Um, I thought I did, uh, or I saw that. So, um, I'll see you guys once I figure out the name. Oh, okay, what happened? Alright guys, so once you guys are here, the tool is called Snipping Tool, so you guys are going to search on Katana or whatever you have, and you're going to search Snipping, snipping Tool, so you're just going to uh, search that, excuse me, oh my gosh, there, um, Alright, so once you guys uh, went to snipping tool, I have no idea what happened. Let's just go back there. Snipping tool. I'm going to open this. Alright, so once you guys have opened snipping tool, you guys are going to go to new. And you guys are going to snip like this. Now, okay, let's do it new. Oh my gosh, what happened? Okay, so we're just going to snip a picture like that. Okay, so now it will be like this. So now you guys can click on file and you guys are going to save it and that is basically how you make a shadow head i hope you enjoyed this video please smash that like button with your nose and comment down below oh um
No. I'm just saying that. I hope you enjoyed this video. Please smash that like button with your nose and comment down below what type of tutorial you guys want me to do next or what type of game you guys want me to play next. And also, don't forget to click that subscribe button and turn on post notifications so you never miss a video that I do. I hope you enjoyed this video. Built an empire.